How did Siddha Shukla, at 40 years old, who was very young, die of heart attack? The fact that he was under 40, he looked fit, he was exercising. So many would want to believe how can an individual under 40, looking fit, died of a heart attack? Today, I'm going to speak on can words kill or steroids? Mohammad Azruddin bhi ek athlete hai. Wo desh ke liye khelta tha. Par match fixing kiya. Usse team se ban kar diya. So the claim that a person does wrong but because he's representing India should not be blamed cannot be true. We want our best athletes to represent India. Who is wrong is wrong. Today a great issue is going on between Sahil Khan and Manoj Patel. Ye ye bhool jate hain ki jahan ye tel laga kar khade hote hain na wahan pe main chief guest hota hu. Agar yaad ho na मनोज पाटिल ने खुदकुशी की कोशिश की और आप पर इल्जाम लगाया कि आपने उन्हें इतना मानसिक रूप से प्रताड़ित किया है कि उनके पास कोई और चारा नहीं था आत्महत्या करने के अलावा आई हैव सीन सो मेनी बॉडी बिल्डर्स कम इन डिफेंस फॉर मनोज पाटिल बट आई हैव नॉट सीन वन बॉडी बिल्डर कम आउट एंड से अगर मनोज पाटिल ने नकली स्टेरॉइड्स भेजा तो ही शुड कम आउट एंड अपोलॉजाइज and be careful not punish him but at least apologize so why am i speaking on this topic because i have been working out for 15 years and i know what is happening in the fitness industry and if steroids are so easily available for the younger generation it is very dangerous and watch till the end to know if manoj patel is right or sahil khan and is selling fake steroids and fake protein okay I once brought Nitrotech which is a USA made protein powder from my gym trainer which has an MRP of 9000 for 6000. I was so happy. After a few months I called him back for the same Nitrotech. His first question was, do you want the same duplicate? So sad. I saw people who wear big brand clothes or shoes. But do you want to eat what food is in the body? What is it? That was the day my eyes opened because profit is in the club. In Muzaffarnagar, there is a national level interstate gang in which three people have been arrested by us who have been arrested in a very large amount of money in which they were making fake supplements. Now, let's come to the main issue. Everyone has to make a body. A young boy sees the body of Salman Khan, Sangram Chogle or Sahil Khan and wants the body like him. But the young boy does not want to wait 15 to 20 years and put in hard work. But he wants the body immediately. So he goes to his gym and asks his trainer for steroids. And his trainer who is training him also wants to make money. So he gives him steroids. This is happening in the fitness industry. So don't be amazed when I lay down facts. Because what a trainer makes in a year of coaching, he can make in months by selling steroids. So promoting steroids in the back is huge. Sab log baat nahi karte, par asal mein baat bik raha hai steroid. But do trainers have the right knowledge to sell steroids? No, it can and must be only prescribed by doctors after a full checkup of a person and the years he spent in fitness. But not just steroids. Fake steroids and fake protein powders are sold so much more than originals because profit is more in fake. So now let's look at what happens when you start using steroids. First hair loss, deep voice which is good which is why transgender men are given testosterone for becoming manly. Liver disease, kidney disease, heart attack. Just check Google to see the rate of heart attack deaths of fit people dying at a very young age. Think of a person who died recently of heart attack at a very young age. If you use steroids and die by 70 to 90 years old, it's still okay. But steroid use death is quick. Anger and depression is a very big problem of steroid use. Do you know Chris Benvo? The famous wrestler who killed his whole family, his kid, and committed suicide 
because of the use of steroids. World in shock today, former champion Chris Benoit found dead in his Atlanta home along with his wife and young son. Police now treating the discovery as a double murder-suicide. Depression and suicidal tendencies are so common due to steroid use because mentally they are so damaged. See what happened to Manoj Patil. Hear what Roni Coleman has to say. But when you think, like, the DEA, shouldn't you be out there catching people selling meth? Yeah, Why but, are you going after bodybuilders who are also cops? That seems ridiculous. Because they had kids out there where they were taking it and committing suicide. And many more side effects which are so dangerous. So, now let's see who is right between Sahil Khan and Manoj Patil. Kaun sa bada jurm hai? Muse nikli baat ya nakli steroid bechne se? So, first let's come to Sahil Khan. The first argument against Sahil Khan is he insulted Manoj Patil and bullied him an athlete representing India. So, if our country, if Pradhan Mantri Shri Narendra Modi is wrong, then we question karte hai. that is the freedom of speech. So, Sahil Khan put up a video of Manoj Patil questioning and making fun of him in social media. But there is a fault on his part. We are not the people who should serve justice. If someone is wrong, he should get a Putting up a video of Raj Pawajdar on his social media handle was correct because he was sharing facts and everything nowadays are on social media. But making fun of someone through social media was not right. Because you guys are celebrities and what you do, your young fans follow. Second argument against Sahil Khan is bodybuilder ko gali diya by saying Jis stage pe tum chaddi pen ke tel laga ke khade hote ho, waha mein chief guest hu. Or icon award ko disrespect karte ho aap log? Ha <laughs> very good. Aukat mat bhulo. Aukat mat bhulo. Aukat. ठीक है जहां खड़े होते हो ना नंगे होकर वहां पे चीफ गेस्ट होता हूं मैं अगर साहिल खान ने ये डायलॉग सभी बॉडीबिल्डरों के लिए बोला था तो बहुत गलत था बट दिस वाज जस्ट अ फाइट बिटवीन टू इंडिविजुअल्स and they both were angry with each other. Think what all we speak during arguments. Ma ki gali, behen ki gali. What will happen if our call recording gets leaked? Does that mean we hate everyone's mothers? No, it is just anger, which is not right and cannot be justified. But insan gusse me bohat kuch bolta hai. But I still feel Sahil Khan should clarify what these words meant or at least apologize. Third argument against Sahil Khan is Jis industry mein paise kama raha hai Unhe hi neecha dikhane ke koshish kar raha hai That I won't support Galti kahi bhi ho If we feel something is not right We have to speak out We don't need to support lies Even if it is family That is how we should be Now let's come to Manoj Patil Before starting anything I would say Manoj Patil to say Truth always, because 10 times changing facts will make it impossible for people to trust you. First argument by Manoj Patil is, Wo Raj Fajdar ko janta hi nahi. Here Raj Fajdar audio where he is speaking to Manoj Patil. Bhai sahab, jada na baat na kare hamare samne, samjha? Tere ko kaisa samal logo liye abe? Aur kaisa itna jaise saman tu bhi use karte tera bataiye mujhe? Theek hai na? Jitna saman tere ko bhejaa hai na, usme tere body bani hai, samjha? Second argument by Manoj Patil is Usne usko kuch bechai nahi. Here his interview to the press where he says he sold only peptides, not knuckly steroids. Third argument by Manoj Patil is he did not sell any fake steroids. Raj Fajdar had presented all the courier details from 2019 when he received the product and shown that the product he received was actually fake steroids. Bhai, I get from a shop, I give someone to someone, it's my guarantee. If it's not my guarantee, I don't give anything to you. Look, you said that you have to play this game, you have to make a body. I said, brother, what you say, I'm going to play this game. I've never said that you have to make a money. I've never said that you have to make a money. I've never said that you have to make a money. Listen, listen. Yes. 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 Yes.
तो तो भाई ये 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 चीज क्या थी ये फिर दी क्यों दी मुझे जब गारंटी नहीं है कुछ साला अबे मरी जाता मैं इनसे ये ये एक्सपायरी है कुछ भी कुछ बोर्ड ही है भाई ये कुछ भी हो जाए सो होप यू ऑल अंडरस्टूड व्हाट इज हैपनिंग टू ऑल माय जिम ब्रदर्स आउट देयर youth of india is trusting every bodybuilder and every fitness trainer so if you love your bodybuilding industry it should be clean from fake products and selling steroids to young people who don't even lift that is how you show your love to bodybuilding not defend bodybuilding by what a person said but defend our love for bodybuilding by showing the youth of india on how to properly take care of our body and be mentally and physically fit this is the message for all those who are going to gyms don't take the easy way staying natural is healthy use good protein powders and brands you trust and stay away from steroids steroids kill all those who loved the video do like the video and comment on your experiences in your gyms and if you're first time visiting the channel don't forget to subscribe lots of love and god bless i'm nas khan